Hey, hi, welcome back on my YouTube channel. So in today's video, we're gonna see uh, chapter three of our new playlist, which is blockchain-based electronic health record system using Hapalaja Fabric. So we have already seen in two videos that our overall use case is going to be, what are the different players and different actors in our complete use case. And we have seen the prerequisites of installation of certain tools, right? So in this video, in today's video, we will install our most important part, the Hapalaja Fabric dependencies. It's a very tricky part. So without any delay, let's get started. But yes, start with the first part. If you haven't subscribed to our channel subscribe yet, then please guys, subscribe, ki share with your friends, share with your communities and let's grow together. Thank you so much. Let's get started. Hey, hi. So uh, now let's get started with respect to downloading the Hapalaja Fabric binaries. So, Binaries download करने के लिए सबसे पहले आपको क्या करना पड़ेगा? The prerequisites you, you must need to have this sudo apt install jq. Jq is required. So to download jq, uh, we just need to do sudo apt install jq hyphen y. ये आप करना. मेरे इसमें ये already download है, so I won't follow this command. And after that second step is हमें ये repository clone करनी पड़ेगी. अभी एक मेरी public GitHub पे मैंने repository बना के रखी है, जिसके अंदर हमारी एक script है. जिससे हम हमारे फैब्रिक बाइनरीज को डाउनलोड करेंगे ठीक है सो यू कैन क्लोन दिस रिपोजिटरी वो यूजिंग दिस कमांड फिर उसके बाद में थर्ड स्टेप हम क्या करेंगे विल सिंपली रीडायरेक्ट टू द चेंज द डायरेक्टरी टू द दिस प्रोजेक्ट एंड राइट द कमांड टू जस्ट जस्ट वी हैव टू हिट दिस इंस्टॉल fabric.sh फाइल टू डाउनलोड आवर बाइनरीज तो अगर आप विंडोज यूज कर रहे होंगे तो यू हैव टू यूज द डब्ल्यूएसएल तो मैंने डब्ल्यूएसएल में हमारा लॉगिन किया है सो यू कैन सी हियर डब्ल्यूएसएल एलएस तो यहां पे मेरे और भी दूसरे बहुत सारे डिफरेंट प्रोजेक्ट्स हैं राइट सो हियर व्हाट यू नीड टू डू फर्स्ट यू हैव टू डू गेट क्लोन क्लोन दैट रिपोजिटरी नेम ओके यू हैव टू कॉपी दिस एंड इस पीपीटी का लिंक मैं डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स में दे दूंगा दिस इज माय गूगल ड्राइव्स पीपीटी गूगल स्लाइड सो यू कैन एक्सेस इट फील फ्री टू यूज दिस पीपीटी यू जस्ट नीड टू कॉपी दिस कमांड एंड पेस्ट इट ओवर हियर सो फॉर मी आई हैव ऑलरेडी क्लोन दिस रिपोजिटरी क्योंकि मैंने यही से क्रिएट करके वहां पे पुश किया राइट सो सिंपली व्हाट आई नीड टू डू सिंपली जस्ट जस्ट चेंज योर डायरेक्टरी टू दिस फोल्डर सो आई हैव जस्ट चेंज इट एलएस राइट so now I can see, uh, so yeah, I have already tested this. So once I tested the scripts, I got these fabric samples created. But don't worry, for you guys, what I can do, uh, I can create. So what I did, I just removed the fabric samples repository. And uh, now we need to do this install. We need to hit this particular file. In this file, what, what is written in this file? So let me show you that as well. So this is my, I opened this in the already <clears throat> Node.js. Oh, sorry, my bad, it, it in, it's in VS code. So where you can see the script. This script is responsible for downloading all the binaries and images required for our Hapalaja Fabric setup. Okay, so it's gonna pull all the required images. Cool. So let's uh, just hit this file. So it will take few few minutes to download, but make sure that before hitting this uh, before hitting this file, you have to switch on your Docker desktop. So here I am using Docker desktop. So I have on this Docker desktop. Right. So, and if you are using the uh, Ubuntu or Mac, if you have your system system Docker like CLI based Docker, so using CLI just open your Docker and then only hit it. Or otherwise, you will get error. Ki, uh, you will get error. You cannot able to pull these images. Okay, cool. So I got this. If you if you get getting some errors, uh, Docker is not found or Docker command is not available, something something like that. So just check your Docker is up or not. Okay. And now we have successfully downloaded it. And uh, if you do ls again, so I can see fabric fam samples is downloaded here. It's set up. So if I go to this uh, VS code, so what is a method to open VS code? Simply you have to write your code dot and then it will download few dependencies and it will open up in your VS code. If you are using VS code, 
uh, then it will work for you. If you are not using VS Code, then you have to open it explicitly from in, in any editor which you use or prefer. Okay. Cool. Now, uh, let's do clear here. So what we can do here, so you can check here is a fabric samples. Let me increase my font a little bit. Yeah. So here fabric samples. So inside this, there is a lot, uh, lot of projects you can see. There is asset transfer, uh, auction sample, builders, config, CI, full stack transfer guide. There are a lot of multiple things, but we'll go step by step, not to worry. We'll check uh, one by one flow. So there are multiple, uh, multiple samples they have given how to set up this type of how to set up token ERC20 in Apple as a fabric, 721, 1155 and uh, UTXO, all those kind of projects. But we'll go step by step, as I mentioned, very first, we'll understand the network. And then on top of that, we'll understand the application, like how to write the chain code and how to use that chain code and so on and so forth. Stuff. So first let's call, uh, let's start it with respect to test network. So now we, our target is to run the network. So network here are, uh, in Apple Ledger fabric, there are multiple stuffs. There is a concept called organization. There is a concept called peer. There is a concept called orderer, right? So orderer is something which is responsible for doing the consensus mechanism and now in this uh, 2.5, we have a capability to use uh, BFT consensus mechanism or raft consensus mechanism. So by default, it's gonna use the raft consensus mechanism over here, okay? So if you want to know more about the raft and BFT, let me know, I'll create a detailed video about that. But more or less, they are uh, leader and follower base uh, consensus mechanism there are one leader who will go is to always convey the messages whenever new transaction hit or whenever new uh, any activity was happening in your network so they will going to say hey this is a transaction and then followers will check that transaction and they'll commit it so once the more number of commit got from the all the followers then that leader will mark that transaction as a successfully committed in the ledger so that's how the consensus happens in raft uh, now uh, 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 so uh, yeah, so let's 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 go inside our fabric samples. Let's go inside fabric samples. Inside fabric samples, there is a test network. Let's go into the test network. Now uh, let's try to run our network. So to run network, I can see there is a one network dot sh file. Okay, there is one network dot sh file. So inside this file, we have a multiple commands to. Uh, they have command to set up a test network with two organization and three orders. Okay. So now let's get started to uh, run this network file. So how to run that network file? Sim pretty simple. Dot forward slash network dot sh and then up command space up. Hit it. So make sure that your docker is up. Agar aapka docker up hoga, this will not run because ye dockerized concept hai, ye docker mein aapke containers banenge. Aapka peer ka container ban gaya hai, order ka container ban gaya hai, and again I can see the peer of org1. So yes, agar aap dekh sakte hain hape, a order ka container bana hamara, okay, a peer ka, a peer uh, of org1 and peer of org2, peer 0 of org1 and peer 0 of org2. So isko achche se dekhne ke liye hum what we'll do, we'll go towards our docker. Let's switch to the docker, and yeah, in container section, if you click on the container, you can see three container are running. Or you, if you are seeing only compost, just open the compost. You can see three containers over here. Peer 0, Peer 0 Org 1, Peer 0 Org 2 and Orderer. Okay. So if you if you can go inside this, you can see uh, what is happening, the logs. So you can see that there are fancy things Because this is all about the networking. Uh, so they will connect with each other. They will create a channel and they will join with that channel. And so on and so forth. So, here we have continuously uh, system chain code level. A hoti hai. So, in upcoming videos, I will explain what is system level chain code and what is uh, normal application level chain code as well. Okay. So, this is the log of this particular container. Now, if you go back, let's check the log of orderer. So, you can see they, they are setting up their TLS certificates. And this is very much important concept. The TLL certs and uh, they are mostly primary keys and private key. Uh, which will use to manage their access level and all those things. 
so this is all about the uh, order so if you are done with these steps so yeah congratulations man you are set up our network properly to check we can do docker ps we have checked from docker desktop as well but to check from cli from command simply we can do docker ps to check the containers and now we need to stop this container as well right because if you won't stop it properly it went into the unexpected mode or uh, in a very bad condition then you will struggle a lot to set up it again yeah. so what we need to do simple command network network dot sh t o w and down just we need to make it down and ye kya karega ye isko stop karega and then they will remove the volumes as well theek hai so usme do command hote hai ek network stop hota hai jo sirf stop karega remove nahi karega the second command is network down which will stop container and then remove the container okay and uske jitne bhi attached artifacts hote hai jaise volumes and network wo sab kuch remove kar dega theek hai मेन एक्टर्स इन आर यूज केस So till that time bye bye jai hind